Hello everyone, we're going to show you how to do a WebEx event as the host. So once you start, you want to hit this record button, because they always say like record what's going on. Okay, you want to record everything. This will turn off your mic and your cam, camera, mic. This will, um, if you need to share content, this is the chat. So this will show you any chat that you have. And then this button will show you the panelists. Now if we see next to Miss Workman, we see a little question mark. That means that she has a question. So if we go to the, I believe it's Q&A right here. So I just unclicked the participants, went to Q&A. This is her question. This is a practice question. And then I can respond. Thank you for your question. And I can send it privately or I can send it so everyone can see. All right. And once again, this shows who's attending. Okay, I can view all attendees. So I got Miss Padilla, Miss Workman in here. All right, this is me, the host. And when I go to back to the panelists, because you want to you want to try and see what the panelists are doing, or sorry, yeah, the attendees, um, I can see if they have any other. Yeah, see, like Miss Workman has her hand raised. Okay, so actually, it doesn't show until you do something. It won't show you. Yeah, see, it says zero displayed. And then, could you give me another reaction, like maybe a happy face, laughter, or applause, or something? See if it'll show. Okay, and as she's doing that, I'll show you other things you can do. So for this um, event, you can also do the recording up here. Okay, um, and then so the recorder settings: record in cloud, record audio. Okay, participant. This is where you can mute all, unmute all. Okay. Communicate, view full screen, and then share. This is the button I'm going to talk about the most. Share, you can share your screen, which will mean it'll show everything that's on my screen. Share a file. Okay. This could be like a video application if you need to share any of these. Um, and then the one I want to talk about the most is a whiteboard. So when I click whiteboard, it's going to give me a whiteboard that I can actually, that my uh, attendees can see. I can draw on it. I can choose a different color if I want. Okay, so if I want to do it in purple, okay, and they can see that. If I want to erase it, I go to my eraser, and I can just click over it, and it'll erase it for me. Okay, you can also um, save what you've put on your whiteboard. Okay, and it'll have it for you. These are different uh, square. This is square shape. This is a line. I think, I think you do other things. Yeah, you can do other different types of shapes. Text. If you have something on here that you want to point, you can put a pointer. So like if I have my answer right here, I can put a pointer there. Now if I accidentally did that, I could also delete. I think if I right click it, it'll ask me if I want to. Oh, and you also have a laser pointer here. Okay. Which they can see. This is if you... Um, I think it's if you want to share the whiteboard to all panelists or all attendees. I really wouldn't mess with that because, I, I, to be honest, I don't know too much about it. But I believe if I want to erase... Oh, yeah, see, I just go here and it says clear my pointer, clear all pointers. All right? And the other thing about whiteboards is you can make multiple whiteboards to share. So if I want another whiteboard, this is my fourth whiteboard. If I want to go back to the previous whiteboard, so maybe I had something important on here. And, oh, I ran out of room. I need to go to another whiteboard. Well, it still saves the previous whiteboard. So I was like, oh, you know, Ms. Morales, I have a question on the third whiteboard. Okay, boom, we're back at it. Um, the reason why it says whiteboard three is because I already had two whiteboards before I started recording, and I deleted them. So if, I, if I'm done with this, you might want to just download it and save it anyway, but you can close it out. And it'll ask, do you want to save the current document before you close it, which is always nice. No, I don't, so there you go. And once I get rid of all my whiteboards, it goes back to my camera. Okay. Um, and yeah, so the right side is where you can see all the different panelists. Okay. And the buttons are, so here's where the panelists would be, and this is where you'd see the reactions. Shares where you would have for the whiteboard, and as well as um, any files or um, if you need to share your screen. Okay. Um, and... Uh, yeah, I think that's about it. Let me see if there's anything else.
event is where you can rec uh, start the recording, but you can also do it down here. And uh, yeah, I believe that's it. I guess you can save. I don't know what, what it says save as. I guess you can save this meeting. But if you have any questions, let me know. I'm still learning about this, but this that's basically everything that I've learned thus far. Um, Ms. Workman, do you think we've covered it all? I think so. Yeah, oh. yeah. If, if my voice is back on, I, I believe you showed them all the different parts. And oh, just, perfect. You need to choose if this is the best avenue, if you want the kids to kind of talk together, or if maybe a screencast is better because it's more of you giving them information. Yeah, exactly. So be cognizant of what do you want from your kiddos. Yes. Yep, and then look, she put applause, so I can see that she's applauded. So that's those are where you can have the reactions, like if it's too fast, too slow, yes, no. That's where you can see it all here with all the different attendees, and you'll I think you'll only see those who are participating at that time. So like Miss Padilla is still in, but she hasn't put anything in there, so I can't see her yet. Um, I know she's in though, because if I go to attendees, I think if I close this and I go to yep, I can see her there. Oh, yep, she has her hand raised. So now I can see that she is participating. And now she put her hand down so that's see that her name is no longer there. All right, I think that's it. Thank you for watching.